गुड इवनिंग व्यूअर्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू प्रिपेयर एयर फ्राइड चिली चिकन नाउ दिस इज नॉट अजल टाइप ऑफ अ चिली चिकन दैट वी मेक द डिफरेंस बींग द चिकन आई यूज विल बी एयर फ्राइड राधर दैन डीप फ्राइड सो दिस रिड्यूस द अमाउंट ऑफ फैट इन द चिकन एंड मेक्स अर चिकन मच मोर हेल्थियर फर्स्ट वी आर गोइंग टू मैरिनेट द चिकन द इनग्रीडियंट फॉर मैरिनेटिंग द चिकन आर टू फिफ्टी ग्राम ऑफ बोनलेस चिकन डाइज इन टू 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 इंच क्यूब्स वाइट विनेगर टू टू थ्री टी स्पून हाफ टी स्पून ब्लैक पेपर सॉल्ट टू टेस्ट हाफ टी स्पून वाइट पेपर थ्री फोर्थ कप ऑफ कॉर्नफ्लॉ हाफ कप ऑफ रिफाइंड फ्लॉ वन वाइट एग टू मैरिनेट द चिकन फर्स्ट थोर वॉशिंग ऑफ चिकन इज रिक्वायर्ड अंडर रनिंग वॉटर The second step is now the chicken has to be pat dried. It shouldn't be uh, left wet. The pieces of the chicken should be distributed evenly. After pat drying the chicken, the chicken pieces are transferred to a dry bowl. Okay. To marinate the chicken, all of the ingredients shown henceforth are put in the bowl at all at a single go. The chicken pieces are thoroughly coated with the ingredients told. Now we have made the uh, now our marinade is ready. So we are going to, we are going to refrigerate it for the next two hours. By the time our chicken gets marinated, we prepare our sauce for the dish. These are the in ingredients that are required for the sauce: green chilies, two de-seeded, chopped; ten to twelve cloves of garlic, finely chopped; three teaspoons of white vinegar; half cup cornstarch; two teaspoons ginger garlic paste. Half teaspoon white pepper, half teaspoon black pepper, three to four onions diced, one large bell pepper diced, salt to taste. These are the sauces that would be used to prepare our main sauce, starting from red chilli sauce, tomato ketchup, and green chilli sauce. Our chicken has been marinated and now it is ready to be air fried. We, what we are going to do is we are going to preheat the air fryer. Up to the required temperature, that is 180 degrees Celsius, and then we are going to uh, air fry the chicken for 15 to 20 minutes until golden brown. 
Our air fryer has been preheated up to a temperature of 180 degrees Celsius and our chicken can be placed inside it for cooking. Now we have to cook the chicken in the air fryer for 15 to 20 minutes or until the chicken is golden brown. The chicken should be greased with uh, cooking olive oil regularly. Now we have transferred the chicken to a bowl and we start to prepare the sauce. We begin by heating oil in the non-stick pot. Now the oil is heated. We begin to prepare the sauce by first adding the ginger garlic paste. We add all the soft finely chopped garlic. We simmer down the gas so as to prevent their burning and over And then finally, we add the deep little bean thing. The contents are thoroughly sorted. Care is taken not to overcook these, uh, these vegetables so as to preserve the flavor. After the garlic turns a little brown and starts and started to start to give it aroma, we add the dried onions. After the onions are nearly done, we add in the capsicum. Here is taken that the vegetables are not fully cooked and they are kept a bit raw so that it provides uh, an aroma and a taste to the dish. Now we are going to add water so as to improve the consistency of the sauce. We are adding 2 cups of water. While we add water the gas is again bring to a full heat. Now we add all our spices. First we begin by adding salt. Salt is to be added according to taste. It's impossible. Black pepper around half teaspoon. White pepper around half teaspoon. By the time our sauce gets ready, we prepare the cornstarch for thickening of the sauce. The cornstarch is prepared by mixing the cornstarch powder in a half cup of cold water so as to prevent clumping of the cornstarch. We are going to mix the cornstarch powder in the water thoroughly to prevent formation of lumps. Now our water has boiled and we add soy sauce to bring the black color of the sauce. Now we are going to add corn flour to the sauce. We are going to add corn flour in portions to prevent formation of lumps. The added one is constantly stirred.
the corn flour was added to thicken the sauce and now as you can see the sauce has thickened the consistency of the sauce has changed after the sauce uh, become, comes to a boil the sauce is tasted and the sauce is altered according to the taste of the person by adding uh, red chilli sauce green chilli sauce and tomato sauce in required proportions During the addition of the sauce, the flame is lower. A green chilli sauce has, is now being added. Now our sauce is cooked. That, that is, it has become much thickened. So we add the cooked pieces of chicken to the sauce. After adding the pieces, the sauce is again cooked for two to three minutes on low flame. After 2 to 3 minutes when the chicken is cooked and the sauce is cooked, we switch off the burner and add the vinegar to the sauce, to the dish. After adding the vinegar, the sauce is stirred and is covered with the lid for and kept for 5 to 10 minutes. Now our dish is ready, it is giving beautiful aroma and flavor, so we now transfer it to a serving dish. The dish is served hot with chicken fried rice or noodles. Kindly like, comment and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.